Hello guys, today we're going to be breaking down the update. Oh, update week. To be more accurate. Post by Flashbow Andres, a developer from uh, Flashbow. Okay, good afternoon. So, first picture. We have a plane with a minigun. I'm guessing this is just concept art, or maybe it's one of the the pirates, which I'll be discussing in a second. Awesome designs, maybe new cockpit potential, interesting stuff. There's hot air balloon. Also, pirate. And the most interesting part about this is the minigun, which could be implemented. Well, I'm guessing it's going to be high fire rate, low damage. Okay, next part. Says it will come along 1.6, so they're gonna be releasing two updates from what I can tell. So it's gonna be one big update, which is like two parts together in summer. So the update will be free, but there will be, I think, the campaign and expansion area will be free. free. Um, here's some introductions. Um, so, High Sea is a huge map. But apparently, this thing is even bigger than High Seas. Apparently, there's a new campaign storyline, which storyline lore um, that could be very interesting to talk about. New combat mechanics. The, game, the developers always say that they don't want their game to be about you know shooting, fighting, combat, and stuff like that. They want to be more of a engineering solution type game. But there are going to be new combat mechanics. So yeah, that's interesting. There's gonna be enemies, or as they like to call it, air pirates. Friendly NPCs, which I I really think they're not gonna work well because of um there's it's a small company, Flashbulb. Or should I say uh game designers? Um developers, whatever you wanna call it. Uh I f there's gonna be AI, there's NPCs. New blocks, which includes wings, which that will be very fun. We'll be looking at some of those wings. Alright, and here's the map. Go really quickly into it. I'm just going to discuss. It's going to be a skylines area, just flying cliffs, more cliffs, big mountain, valley, which I'll probably do some top and stuff in. Interesting little hill base thing. And there's three points of interest from this. Um, <clears throat> one, they're gonna be actually adding structures like buildings. Why is there a picture of? Okay, that's interesting. Uh, they're gonna be adding like buildings and stuff like that instead of just you know random roads and structures, which I just now realized is supposed to be like a plane cockpit thing, like these domes. The, I'm learning more and more the more I look at it. This is supposed to be like a plane cockpit, apparently. So that's only like an A320 or maybe a 787. I have no idea. I'm not a, I'm not a commercial plane guy. And second point of interest this looks exactly like a mod map. So there's a mod I forgot who's created by, but there is a modded map which has this exact same old sand structure of the bones sticking out the ground. Now let's move on to the video. So, beginning here, there's not much that's interesting in getting. I'm discussing a few points here. First point, um, crosshair, most evident part that you can see from here. S um, second part. Uh, there's this compass, which is interesting. I wonder if it'll become a thing in maybe free play, where you can s in multiplayer, where you can see other people, so you don't actually have to go into the map and look for where your friends are during, for example, like a dogfight. Uh, I'm guessing that might be toggleable if that's a thing. And next thing, there's a sort of Battlefront 2 style mission, I guess. Where, uh, like in Battlefront 2, you have to shoot down the shield generators for the spaceship, right? 
and you can then take down the base. There's multiple steps to that. Which I'm guessing these things are shield generators. Oh, we'll let see the video. And let's look at some more or less evident things. These are going to be new control surfaces. They're talking about new wings and blocks. New control surfaces right here. And finally, from what I can tell, um, there's going to be this mouse click button. So usually you'd have to set it up weirdly with like a controller or whatever. To, um, I'm not entirely sure how to do it, but you could get le left mouse click as a controller in the plane, which a lot of people use that for guns, which I've done that too. It's pretty much everything from what I can tell now. And we're gonna look at that explosion again. So, first of all, there's gonna be a damage model for the NPCs, which it's a little bit different for the player, but for the um, for the actual enemies, the pirates, is going to be more like a you just shoot them down type deal. So once the, their hull is low, they'll just explode. And we can see some weird fireworky explosions, which I very much disapprove of. I don't know what it looks like. Secondly, these guns are turning to run some kind of hinges, I think. Or maybe the guns automatically have these controls or they hold on to the cursor. See that? Uh, how he's pointing the gun towards the enemy. Explode. And they die. Here we can see it happening now where that happens right there, where the gun turns. That's pretty close. And another thing that a lot of people didn't mention, or notice, I guess, um, is right here. I think there's going to be a new level up system where you can get new weapons and stuff for killing pirates. 30, 15. Skip ahead a little bit. Oh yeah, also, um, the player got shot earlier from this pirate. Here. So for the player, it's going to be more of a molden look where pretty much every part takes like a little bit of molden damage and when that part has been hit enough times, it will that did destroyed. Here. Here, so, um, in the video, whoever's recording this, which I'm guessing it's, um, Flashbull Andreas, from the Flashbull team, you got, like, this weird puffy smoke, which simulates in a real-life plane that's going down. Don't be on a fireball. Another thing, Here's what I'm guessing is a shield generators. Right there. Gonna come around here. And there's one block I'd like you to look at, which is gonna be hard for you to tell, but there is a f a little block right there. So these blocks right here, these like here, right here. You can kind of see it more clearly. They're, they look like a 3 by 2 block, 3 by 2 by one And they look like they're just gonna draw bombs, which could be really interesting. Like, I like just putting a, just a bunch of them together in like a B-52 or whatever, and having just hundreds of bombs drop. I don't think that's gonna be a free play though, I think that's gonna be a this game mode only type dealio. I'm guessing these are the shield generators that they're trying to take down. And final port of interest from here, is um these little hot air balloons are gonna be like enemies shooting them down and find a little bit um we got a little you guys see a little bit of um so you see how um the bullets hit there and once it's been hit enough it would you know kill it and it looks like that's it so that'll be it for today thank you much for andreas and I'd just like to say, uh, I will probably won't be responding to any comments for the next week or two. I'm going to be going out of town. Uh, I'll have a couple videos scheduled for that. See you guys in a week or so. Bye.